2014, Rhythms from Around the World. We are led by our German conductor, Carolyn Remy, with fabulous support from Nise Meruno on the piano. Nise is the sensation from Nagaland. And we also have the multi-talented Suchet Malhotra on percussion. Before the choir takes the stage, I request that you all kindly put your mobile phones on silent mode. Thank you. So sit back, relax, enjoy the performance, and thank you once again for being here. Ladies and gentlemen, the Capital City Minstrels.
journey through the world. We have just presented Adiamus by Welsh composer Carl Jenkins, which combines classical and ethnic influences to create a haunting tribal sound. In the following section, we bring you to Europe, Scotland and Germany. Loch Lomond is a freshwater loch lying in the Highland Boundary Fault, often considered the boundary between the lowlands of central Scotland and the Highlands. There is a story that the song we will perform tonight was performed by a Scottish soldier who awaited death in enemy captivity. In his final letter home, he wrote this song portraying his home and how much he would miss it. Der Mond ist aufgegangen, The Moon Has Risen, is a poem from Matthias Claudius, one of the most famous poems of German literature. As a song, it is often used as a lullaby. But before all that, with Sia Hamba, a hymn that originated in South Africa in the 1950s, we will bring you to Africa.
which captures a celebratory mood and ethnic flavor of Hanukkah, a Jewish festival. The middle section tells of the Hanukkah tradition. Light the candles, put them in the window, burn them bright for all the world to see. This is followed by the magical composition of May It Be from the Lord of the Rings soundtrack. And we bring you back from Middle Earth to the French 1500s with Pierre Atenion's Tourdier.
We start this next section with a lively Hungarian folk song, Dona Dona. This is arranged by Laros Bardos, one of the pillars of Hungarian choral music in the last century, along with Kudai. With this song, we then fly across into East Asia with Ari Ram, a Korean folk song, often considered the unofficial national anthem of Korea, and recently, in 2012, added by UNESCO to the list of intangible cultural heritage of humanity. We end this section by hopping back to Africa with Maya Hoffer's ever-popular gospel arrangement of Yaka Naka Vangeli. <coughs>
based on Ben Johnson's early 1600s poem, Song to Celia. You might know the melody of the song, as Rabindranath Tagore, the Nobel Prize winning Indian poet, adapted the tune in his poem, Koto Bar Bebe Chino. The second song will be Sing We and Chant It by the 16th century English composer Thomas Morley.
require, with a lot of devotion, with a lot of love, a lot of attention, cooperation, they have really presented, I think, a very lively concert today. Thank you so much for being such a cool house. 